On March 23rd and 24th, the ACFS Traditional Support Unit hosted a survival skills camp for Aquazos Lona. The reason why we wanted to put this together um, is for the people. To re-establish that connection back to the land, I feel like a lot of the way we live today is so fast-paced and we're always going, 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 going that we need to still remember that we're on and we're connected to our Mother Earth. The camp, which was facilitated by instructors Angelo Johnson and Eric Sunday, taught participants land-based survival skills. Anything could happen where you find yourself in a situation where you got to get warm, you got to get dry, you got to get fed, and to practice these skills beforehand are important. By the end of the camp, those who participated learned fire starting, water purification, shelter building, and bushcraft skills. I think it's important that we teach our youth to be out into the nature because to connect with the land and it takes them away from the everyday, their phones, their connection to social media, where they're hands-on learning. We all got that feeling of, wow, this is, this is what we need to be doing. It's nice to see the kids with happy faces. Everyone who was a part of the camp enjoyed learning these important skills. My favorite part of survival camp was building my shelter. Learning how to make fires and shelters. Setting up the camp, you know, learning how to like skin a rabbit. Doing the fires. Doing the fires was fun. Learning how to start fires and skinning rabbits. Learning about how to survive like out in the wilderness. I just spending time in the woods with the kids, you know. Um, I thought the rabbit was a good, good thing, you know, teaching them how to get what you need out of the woods and, and survive. We had to make fires, set up a camp, and cook the bunny, caught bunnies, learn how to trap them. It's a lot of fun. Seeing everybody do all of this stuff and making a fire. I enjoyed it all. Kids the last two days has uh, been an uh, incredible uh, awakening for them as well as for us because we need to keep this going for our future generations and it's been very fulfilling. I hope it continues.